life, we all face moments that test us to our core. Whether it's a personal loss, a career setback, a period of uncertainty, or simply the daily pressures of living in a fast-paced, ever-changing world, these challenges can feel overwhelming. But within each of us is the capacity to rise above, to adapt, and to grow stronger. This capacity is called resilience, a mental strength that allows us to face adversity with courage and to bounce back from hardship. Resilience isn't just a trait we're born with or without, it's a skill we can cultivate, a practice we can develop. Building resilience is like strengthening a muscle, the more we work at it, the stronger it becomes. So, how do we begin to cultivate this inner strength? It starts with shifting our mindset. Many of us are taught to avoid pain and discomfort, to seek comfort and predictability. But the reality is, life is full of unexpected twists and turns. Resilient people don't avoid difficulties, they lean into them, viewing each challenge as an opportunity for growth. This shift in mindset helps us see setbacks not as roadblocks, but as stepping stones. When we stop fearing failure and start welcoming it as a learning experience, we take the first steps toward mental resilience. One key to resilience is cultivating self-awareness. Understanding our own responses to stress, our fears, and our emotional triggers can empower us to make conscious choices rather than reactive ones. When we're aware of what unsettles us, we can start to work on managing those responses in healthy ways. Meditation, journaling, and mindfulness practices are powerful tools that help build this self-awareness. By making these practices a part of our routine, we create a foundation of calm within ourselves, which gives us more stability during turbulent times. Equally important is developing a support system. Resilient people don't go through life alone. They lean on friends, family, mentors, or even support groups. When we feel supported, we gain the strength to keep going even when things feel insurmountable. If you're facing a difficult time, reach out to someone you trust, share your experience, and accept help when it's offered. Connection reminds us that we are not alone in our struggles and that there is power in community. Next, let's talk about adaptability, the ability to adjust our approach when things don't go as planned. Life rarely follows a straight path, and sometimes the most resilient thing we can do is to let go of what we envisioned and embrace new possibilities. Adaptability doesn't mean giving up on your goals, it means finding creative ways to pursue them, even if it means taking an unexpected detour. It's about being flexible in your thinking, willing to change course when necessary, and open to exploring alternatives when your first plan doesn't pan out. Another aspect of resilience is cultivating optimism, not blind positivity, but a realistic, hopeful outlook. This involves learning to see setbacks as temporary and surmountable, and believing that better days are ahead. Optimism fuels us with the motivation to keep moving forward, even when the path is difficult. It's the mindset that reminds us that, no matter how dark the moment, we have the strength to persevere. Cultivating gratitude can also foster optimism. By focusing on what we have rather than what we lack, we nurture a sense of abundance and possibility. Finally, building resilience means embracing self-compassion. Resilient people are not immune to self-doubt or frustration, but they don't beat themselves up for feeling these emotions. Instead, they treat themselves with kindness, acknowledging that it's okay to feel vulnerable. Self-compassion reminds us that we are human, and that being resilient doesn't mean we have to be perfect. It means we accept ourselves as we are, flaws and all, and give ourselves the grace to grow at our own pace. Developing resilience is a journey, not a destination. Each step we take to build this mental strength fortifies us for the next challenge that life presents. By embracing a growth mindset, cultivating self-awareness, building connections, staying adaptable, fostering optimism, and practicing self-compassion, we create an inner resilience that can weather any storm. Resilience isn't about being unbreakable. It's about being able to bend without breaking, to bounce back after setbacks, and to keep moving forward, no matter what. <music>